This section should give knowledge regarding the different threats of ballast water. Marine species are being carried around the world in ships' ballast water. When discharged into new environments, they may become invasive and severely disrupt the native ecology, impact economic activities such as fisheries, and cause disease and even death in humans. Unlike an oil spill, which can be cleaned up, the effects of marine species introductions are usually irreversible. It is estimated that more than 7,000 different species are carried around the world in ships' ballast each day. Every nine weeks, a marine species invades a new environment somewhere in the world. The following species have already hitchhiked with ballast water around the world and created damage to the environment. North American comb jelly. North Pacific Sea Star Zebra Mussel Asian Kelp European Green Crab Round Goby Toxic Algae Mitten Crab Cladoceran Water Flea Cholera Click on the icons for more information. North American Comb Jelly Nemoopsis lydia, native to eastern seaboard of the Americas, introduced to Black, Azov, and Caspian seas. Impacts, reproduces rapidly, self-fertilizing hermaphrodite under favorable conditions. Feeds excessively on zooplankton, depletes zooplankton stocks, altering food web and ecosystem function contributed significantly to collapse of Black and Azov Sea fisheries in 1990s, with massive economic and social impact. Now threatens similar impact in Caspian Sea. North Pacific Sea Star Asterius amurensis Native to Northern Pacific Introduced to Southern Australia. Impacts. Reproduces in large numbers, reaching plague proportions rapidly in invaded environments. Feeds on shellfish, including commercially valuable scallop, oyster and clam species. Zebra mussel. Dresena polymorpha. Native to Eastern Europe, Black Sea. Introduced to Western and Northern Europe, including Ireland and Baltic Sea, eastern half of North America. Impacts. Fouls all available hard surfaces in mass numbers. Displaces native aquatic life. Alters habitat, ecosystem and food web. Causes severe fouling problems on infrastructure and vessels. Blocks water intake pipes, sluices and irrigation ditches. Economic costs to USA alone are around 750 million US dollars to 1 billion US dollars between 1989 and 2000. Asian Kelp Undaria pinatifida Native to Northern Asia. Introduced to Southern Australia, New Zealand, West Coast of USA, Europe and Argentina. Impacts. Grows and spreads rapidly, both vegetatively and through dispersal of spores. Displaces native algae and marine life. Alters habitat, ecosystem and food web. May affect commercial shellfish stocks through space competition and alteration of habitat. European Green Crab Carcinus myenus 
native to European Atlantic coast, introduced to southern Australia, South Africa, USA, and Japan. Impacts: highly adaptable and invasive, resistant to predation due to hard shell, competes with and displaces native crabs, and becomes a dominant species in invaded areas. Consumes and depletes a wide range of prey species, alters intertidal rocky shore ecosystem. Round goby, Neogobius melanostomus, native to Black, Azov, and Caspian seas. Introduced to Baltic Sea and North America. Impacts. Highly adaptable and invasive, increases in numbers and spreads quickly, competes for food and habitat with native fishes, including commercially important species, and preys on their eggs and young, spawns multiple times per season, and survives in poor water quality. Toxic algae. Red, brown, green tides. Native to various species with broad ranges. Introduced to several species have been transferred to new areas in ship's ballast water. Impacts may form harmful algae blooms. Depending on the species, can cause massive kills of marine life through oxygen depletion, release of toxins, and or mucus. Can foul beaches and impact on tourism and recreation. Some species may contaminate filter feeding shellfish, and cause fisheries to be closed. Consumption of contaminated shellfish by humans may cause severe illness and death. Mitten crab, Iochia sinensis. Native to Northern Asia. Introduced to Western Europe, Baltic Sea, and West Coast North America. Impacts: undergoes mass migrations for reproductive purposes, burrows into riverbanks and dikes, causing erosion and siltation, preys on native fish and invertebrate species, causing local extinctions during population outbreaks. Interferes with fishing activities. Cladoceran water flea, Carcopagus pengoe. Native to Black and Caspian seas. Introduced to Baltic Sea. Impacts: reproduces to form very large populations that dominate the zooplankton community and clog fishing nets and trawls. With associated economic impacts, cholera, vibrio cholerae, various strains, native to various strains with broad ranges, introduced to South America, Gulf of Mexico, and other areas, impacts. Some cholera epidemics appear to be directly associated with ballast water. One example is an epidemic that began simultaneously at three separate ports in Peru in 1991, sweeping across South America, affecting more than a million people and killing more than 10,000 by 1994. This strain had previously been reported only in Bangladesh. When fisheries, coastal industry, and other commercial activities and resources are disrupted by the invading species, it is estimated that the cost of all invasive species is in the vicinity of 183 billion U.S. dollars per year in the U.S.A. alone. When toxic organisms, diseases, and pathogens are introduced through ballast water, causing illness and even death in humans.